Welcome to the first episode of the Feel Good with Fitness series, where we explore the wonderful world of endorphins and how they can transform our mental and physical health. Today, we'll dive deep into the science behind endorphins and how they can help us feel happier, less stressed, and more energized. So grab a notebook and let's get started. What are endorphins? Endorphins are natural chemicals produced by the body that bind to the same receptors as opioids, such as morphine or heroin. They're often referred to as the feel good chemicals because they can create a sense of euphoria and pleasure. How are endorphins produced? Endorphins are produced by the pituitary gland and the hypothalamus in response to certain stimuli, such as stress, pain, and exercise. When we engage in physical activity, our bodies release endorphins as a natural painkiller to help us push through the discomfort. Why are endorphins important? Endorphins have a wide range of benefits for our mental and physical health. They can help reduce stress and anxiety, alleviate pain, improve mood, and even boost the immune system. Endorphins also play a role in addiction and reward pathways in the brain, which can explain why exercise and other endorphin-releasing activities can be so addictive. How can we trigger the release of endorphins? There are many ways to trigger the release of endorphins, including exercise, laughter, and even spicy foods. Exercise is one of the most effective ways to release endorphins because it can produce a sustained increase in these chemicals over time. Other activities that can release endorphins include meditation, massage, and listening to music. Conclusion That's a brief overview of the science behind endorphins and why they're so important for our mental and physical health. In the next episode, we'll focus specifically on how exercise can trigger the release of endorphins and why it's such an effective way to boost our mood and reduce stress. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more episodes.